Hi guys, in this video, I'll show you how to wire a light sensor using Tinkercad. The light sensor is a tool for detecting light intensity, and it's commonly used in projects like automatic lighting systems. By the end of this video, you'll see how everything connects and works. This is what your final project product would look like. Okay, to start, I'll gather all the components we need. First is the Arduino Uno board. This one right here. And next, I'll need a photoresistor, which is also known as our light sensor. Then I'll get a resistor. This is just like a general resistor. Okay, so the photoresistor goes here and the resistor will connect in series with it. You need a resistor because they are used in all kinds of circuits from helping LEDs keep it to keep from burning out and to adjust the frequency of a radio signal. I'll start by placing the photoresistor and resistor in Tinkercad and I'll arrange them directly using connected to the Arduino pins. We can use our breadboard, however, to be simple, we don't need to include it. Okay, now I'm gonna connect the power and ground for the circuit. The 5V pin on the Arduino will connect directly to one leg of the photoresistor. And the other leg will connect to the ground. I'm going to do this so that I keep all my wires organized and you can see all the wires. This will complete the circuit's basic power flow. Now we have to connect the sensor's output to Arduino. Okay. I'll connect another wire from this resistor to this terminal. And this will go, went away. And this will connect to analog. We connect it to analog because the light sensor can be in can be in any range from one to ten it's not only one or only zero it's going to be any range in between uh, this configuration this configuration allows the arduino to read the light intensity as the voltage value so this is it for the wiring i'm going to click start simulation now so we can change the light intensity using this this bar and you can see how the sensor values change when we adjust the light levels and that's it. We've successfully wired a light sensor using Tinkercad. I hope this walkthrough helps you in your projects. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out. Thanks for watching.